I'm going to talk about something that you sent me. That when you sent it to me, I was in awe. Come on, show me. Claims, study claims more American men are being hospitalized for having foreign objects stuck in their rectum. I told y'all this shit long time ago when I was online with Shekana Joe. The man's G spot is in his asshole. Matt, you're, do you want to see the numbers, Maddie? Let me see the numbers. This is the first. This is the first slide. Uh huh. It says more men, uh, men more likely than women to have foreign objects in rectum. They said seventy-seven point eight percent women, twenty-two point two. Ain't no woman's G spot in her ass. It's in her pussy. <laughs> then it gets deeper. It says what sort of objects were found in people's rectums? Sexual objects, miscellaneous. Bottle, jar, or bottle cap, uh, drugs, <laughs> ball, marble, cans, writing implement, unspecified. <laughs> I want to know what the fuck the unspecified is. We know what the unspecified is. It's called dick. That's what it is. The unspecified is called dick in the ass. It's called dick in the butt. That's what the unspecified is. That's what they didn't want to say. And then we have one more slide, Maddie. This is the age range of, of the things that are happening right here. So it says, which age group most likely have foreign objects in rectum? 20 to 24. Oh, listen, wait, wait, 20 to 24. It's first place. First place. Second place, 25 to 29. It's you young niggas. 30, a third place is 30 to 34. Fourth place is 55 to 56. Fifth place, basically, y'all can see this. Hold on, wait, wait a minute. What my age group at? Your age group is it's forty to forty, forty to forty-four. 45. Yeah, that's the ninth. So we, ninth. you know, I, cause we know what's in the ass. <laughs> it's them young ones that don't know what's up in that. Go back. Let me read that <laughs> okay, shit. Okay, hold on. Let me go back. <laughs> it's them young ones that don't know what's up in the ass. <laughs> we know what's in the ass. So they're forty to forty-four. <laughs> the six to sixty-five, they ain't got much to lose. And the motherfucker seventeenth is what. 17th. I is, mean, 11th is. Oh, 11th is. It's 13 to 19. I mean, 15 to 19. 19 yeah. And the 12th is 75 and older. older. And then 13th is 72, 74. My God. I want to talk about this number 20 to 24 here at the top. <laughs> I don't know who out here telling you hoes these young niggas ain't in that. It ain't, ain't, ain't all the things. <laughs> these young niggas is into the things. Okay. <laughs> Now let's go for the come on, bro. Put the put oh, the chart. I'm trying to see your face. While I'm you breaking talk? the chart down. Okay, go ahead. I'm breaking down the motherfucking chart. Go ahead. These twenty to twenty four year old niggas, y'all already know what's up. <laughs> These niggas is getting fucked. <laughs> it's either they fucking themselves or they using something to fuck themselves. <laughs> These twenty five to twenty nine year old niggas, you get what I'm saying? Uh-huh. They knew. They know what. They know what the G spot at. <laughs> These 30 to 34 year old niggas, I'm talking to you bitches out there that be talking about some my man, my man, this is my man, motherfucking that. You know what I'm saying? You bitches that be trying to t- stare me down <laughs> and tell me what they no nigga doing. The statistics is telling you otherwise. <laughs> then you got the 50 to 56 year old niggas. <laughs> The no, one, the, the 55, one, the 50, 55, the, 50, the 59. 59 that's been calling bitches phones, <laughs> the, the, the prostitute phones. <laughs> God, can you shove a bottle of juice in my ass? Really? Yes. Oh, Lord. But I want to go back to these young niggas. <laughs> those are the, those are the, uh, those are the fluid niggas. You mean to tell me you hoes not looking at these numbers and these statistics and go back to the other page. Which one? Where the motherfucker said what's in their ass. Oh, this. Huh? Sexual object. <laughs> number one and number eight are both dicks. <laughs> oh. Number one and number eight are both penises. You play it when you fuck, don't fuck with your wife, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Don't fuck with your wife, bitch. Oh my goodness. You keep out here believing these motherfucking folk when they tell you the lies that they tell about what they don't know. You keep believing this shit if you want to. But I have a question, Maddie. What's the mis- what's the miscellaneous object? What are the miscellaneous objects? What do you think those are? Dildos. 
But are those the sexual objects? Oh, miscellaneous objects. Yeah, what are the miscellaneous objects? Spoons, brushes. Oh, okay. I said a nigga that's something. Well, if I let you see my Snapchat, you'll be like, nah. <laughs> Them niggas be on Snapchat, Snapchat me spoons and shit in their ass. Are you serious? Pencils, brushes. I just be like, oh, dear God. Are you serious? I just don't even. Well, brother, come and put this lash on. I just don't even. You said spoons? You said spoons, man? Spoons, lash it, broom, t- broom tips. I, oh. I, done, I done seen a lot of shit. And some motherfucking body told says to me that I don't that I'm I want to be a woman. Bitch, I want to be a trans motherfucker sexual. Cause I get to see it all. Oh wow. I get to see all that shit. So I can be like, ooh, shit. I get to see all that shit. I get to know all of that shit. Man, have you heard about the man of judgment that shot his doctor in the chest because the doctor made him orgasm during his process? <laughs> That's what a G spot at on a man is in the ass. I told y'all this. Oh wow. Okay. Learns up new every day. Learns I told day. y'all this. I told y'all this shit. Nobody don't want to live. Listen to me. Y'all think I just be a punk over here just talking. I'm 46 years old. I was a prostitute for majority of my life. Bitch, I didn't experience shit. That's crazy. I have experienced seeing, heard, communicated, talked. I just was talking about this shit on my Instagram on how I know more mo about niggas. One, because I am a nigga. And two, because I done fucked a lot of niggas. And I done been in, the, I done been in that dark place where niggas be at. I'm going to put these lashes back on me. What they see this? What this called? Kiss? Oh, okay. Damn. Toothbrushes, candles. Toothbrush. I done seen all types of shit in the motherfucker. I done seen a man sitting down on some shit. That I was like, hold on, can you stand up? Let me see what that is. Broom. And I'm a whole damn transsexual woman and don't want no broom in my ass. If it ain't got no soul connected to it, I don't want it in my ass. That's why I can't fuck no deal though. Yeah, I can't fuck that's... no deal though, cause it don't have no soul attached to it. it. Ain't got no, ain't no spirit on it. That's the only reason why. Ain't no spirit on it. That's ain't the no, only reason ain't why. Ain't no spirit on it. No nuts on it. Not, not because it can. Ain't pa- no spirit on it. Not because it can paralyze you if it if if it goes too deep. I mean, if the broom had a soul on it, I'd probably ride it. Oh Shit. my gosh, really? And they really? call in the corner. <laughs> I'll take thee away into my garden of magic. So, so wait, Maddie, if it had a soul, you wouldn't mind. Yeah, it's alive. <laughs> <laughs> so that for you, there's no such thing as too big. So for you, there's no such thing as too big. I'm not gonna go all the way down on the broom. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Oh my goodness. I wouldn't go all the way down on the damn broom. <laughs> Someone said not nah, hocus pocus. You're right. <laughs> if it, that's what I said. If it had a soul on it, I'll slide. Oh, little children, I'll, I'll mount it and ride it. I'll take thee away oh. into my garden of magic. Oh my goodness. Shit. Anything with a soul got magic attached to it. Is you crazy? Anyway. That's wild. That's wild. <laughs> so it said, not the bottle caps. <laughs> <laughs> Man? Damn, I did not know it was, I didn't know it was like that, though. Um. So they said, Betty said, if she don't spit, she don't want to write. Shit, you know. I'm sorry. Call me what you want to call me. But you know, I'm now, I'm now I'm in that group of 40, 40 something to fifty. What is it, bitch? Hold on, let me what go back. What was it, Mo? I'm let in that group. Hey, it's skin potions. Oh, we got to talk about skin potions too. Yes. In a second. I, I, I'm I gave him a group. shout out too. I'm in that group forty to forty four. <laughs> Hold on, wait, because no. they ain't got forty. Oh, I'm in that group forty five to forty nine. Excuse me. I'm in that group. This group seven. I'm in group eight. 
You in group eight? Yeah, that's my age range. 35 to 39? Yeah, but... Yo, nigga, you getting up there, but you don't want nothing in your ass. I don't want nothing in my ass. And listen, I really don't want a man that want nothing in his ass, but you uh, know what? The, wait, the older I'm getting shit, hey, uh, you know, let, let us both have a hit our G spot. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Let us both hit our motherfucking G spot. No, I'm good. I'm, I'm actually good on that. No, you never know. You <laughs> never know. You know uh, what I'm saying? You probably get out there like four. I hear walking again, being walked like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> you pull up to my house playing Santana. I'm like, oh shit, he done went out there and tried so. <laughs> I'm going to be watching you. You pull up to my motherfucking house playing Santana. <laughs> <laughs> 